We want to solve the given equation. The solution is a value of x that satisfies the equation or makes the equation true. For the first step, we need to simplify both sides of the equation by combining like terms. Notice on the left side of the equation, we have two x terms, three x and eight x are like terms, and on the right side, we also have two like terms, negative two and negative two are also like terms. So combining like terms on the left, three x plus eight x is eleven x. The left side simplifies to eleven x plus eight equals on the right side, negative two minus two is negative four. The right side simplifies to negative four plus seven x. Now that both sides are simplified, we need to add or subtract to isolate the variable terms on one side of the equation. Notice right now we have 11x on the left and 7x on the right. Let's undo the positive 7x on the right by subtracting 7x on both sides. Simplifying, on the left, 11x minus 7x is 4x. The left side simplifies to 4x plus eight equals on the right side, 7x minus 7x is zero which is why we subtracted seven x on both sides. The right side simplifies to negative four. We still don't have the x term isolated. We now need to undo the plus eight by subtracting eight on both sides of the equation. Simplifying, on the left, eight minus eight is equal to zero. The left side simplifies to four x. We have four x equals on the right, negative four minus eight is negative 12. Now that we have the variable term isolated, the last step is to multiply or divide in order to solve for x. And since four x means four times x, to undo the multiplication and solve for x, we now divide both sides by four. Simplifying, four divided by four simplifies the one, one times x is x. We have x equals on the right, negative 12 divided by four is equal to negative three. The solution is x equals negative three, and let's go ahead and verify this by substituting negative three for x back into the original equation to make sure it does satisfy the equation or make the equation true. Performing this substitution, we have three times negative three plus eight plus eight times negative three equals on the right, negative two plus seven times negative three minus two. And now let's evaluate the expression on the left and on the right using a calculator. Notice the expression on the left simplifies to negative 25 and the expression on the right also simplifies to negative 25. This gives us negative 25 equals negative 25, which is true, verifying the solution is correct. I hope you found this helpful.